Obviously over the last few months, there's been a storm brewing. Football club got put into administration. Um, the whole DW stadium, the whole package has been put up for sale. It looks like worst case, the town of Wigan could lose its football club. We can get this ground and football club owned again. Uh, we can live sustainably. It can be there for the people of Wigan to come and watch the football team. And, and we can have a really promising future after um, a summer of devastation, really. I'm going to sit next to Trump. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'll sit next to the barrack actually, I'll have Even from, just from a commercial perspective, there's perhaps maybe 300,000 people who come into the town just to watch football, whether from Wigan or from other towns, and that brings a lot of money in from like the bars and hotels and restaurants. But for me and for the thousands who do come, it's just something to do on Saturday afternoon. And it's, you build your whole week around it, you, you look forward to it. Every town should have its football club or you know, a rugby club, a sports club, something that's there for the, for the people to get excited about and to revolve their life around, as, as well as music and everything else that people yeah. like to think. Imagine trying to say it, come on. Man. Yeah. Yeah, like I say, it's the community aspect of, of the club what, what uh, is more important than anything. It's not just the football team to the people who do it. It's the, the groups of people who go and the friends you make for life, that, you know, and, and that's, that's what's important about it. It's not just 90 minutes for Wigan, that's never been the thing, it's the people you know and you've stayed with for all your life, basically. Things like, like this, it's still what you class as a family, a community club. I, I genuinely don't think there's another team the way we are, you know what I mean? Like, like club-wise, I think we do they just do things that no other club does. I mean, unfortunately, a few years ago, my wife and I had daughter died, and the club, they were fantastic with us, you know what I mean? They did yeah. all sorts, and it's just things like that. Other clubs don't, they don't do things like that. Yeah. Know? Yeah, yeah, well, we're going to do a verve song at first. Mm -hmm. I need to do the snake. Yeah, I want to do something like, really close to Wigan. It's a great, great tune, and it's just part of the the heritage of the town and it's yeah. kind of northern soul roots it's, and it's brilliant listening to you like we record it it's a, a, a track very worthy and it's sensational i feel like wigan is a very loyal if somebody's loyal back i feel like if you've got a tight-knit community i think that just makes the, the town and everything better the football the music we always pull through stuff like it always happens to we get knockbacks but we always pull through what the ticks <laughs>